Ose, and Ms. Harding 2016. Ooh. I still cannot believe that I hold that title because when it happened, I was so grateful. I still am. Okay, so the competition to me was, I can say a life-changing opportunity because I learned so much about myself. I learned how to speak, I learned how to walk, and till this day, I can say that a lot of how I present myself was from that competition. And I think it's also because I entered, I entered the competition twice before I actually took the crown. The first two times I didn't win and I wanted it so bad that I had to go for the third time. So third time was my lucky time, I took the crown. So also I think because of that, because of my fighting spirit and my spirit of I will not give up, I feel like me going there three times was me learning about myself three times, which was I'm so grateful I did that. I don't regret anything. Um, I learned so much. I did things that I never thought that I would do, especially at such a young age, because 2016 was like five years ago. I think I was 17. So my first radio interview was with the team. Um, so they took us to a radio interview because we needed to campaign for the competition because we needed an audience. So we went there. It was so amazing. It was, I was so happy so that i'm grateful for also to anyone who wants to enter the competition i would like to say go for it you have nothing to lose you will learn a lot of interpersonal skills you will learn a lot of um, life skills in general you will learn a lot about yourself as well so it's it's a great experience it's not only about walking and looking pretty it also it does something for your self-esteem it also does something for yourself and that's a lifelong um opportunity uh so yeah if, to anyone who wants to enter the competition i'd like to say go for it you have nothing to lose have fun